Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 31 May 2024. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Deputy Editor Online Madeleine Alnaldi unpacks the conditions for meeting the burgeoning copper demand. With copper demand expected to increase to 41 million tonnes by 2040, many regions are gearing up supply chains for critical metals. It'll be the responsible mining companies that'll rise to the demand challenge and be competitive in the markets. The engineering news features focus on motors, drives and mechanical power transmission, where the time is right to invest in IE3 motors before minimum energy requirement standards are enforced. And heating, ventilation, air conditioning and refrigeration, where a supplier's V-belt range aims to improve HVAC systems uptime. The Mining Weekly features focus on consulting engineers in mining, where the upliftment of engineers is critical to industrial development. And materials, bulk handling and logistics, where a new load haul dumper is engineered for hard rock mining. This week's business leader is Michelle Tinkoff, the Group Commercial and Imports Director at C. Steinweg Group. And as this week's cartoon shows, the election storm, which has just passed, carried with it developments that were at times entertaining, at times revealing, and at times downright disconcerting. Attention will now turn to the governance arrangements that will follow in its wake. Mm -hmm. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.